home with children on Friday, uh, many of those children who face uh, empty homes and empty, empty cupboards. Um, it really struck me as a parent and as someone who volunteered to deliver those packs when I realized these kids in my son's class were going home with no food. And as I saw all of the kids in my son's school racing out on a Friday to go and have weekend and have fun, and I thought about these kids that dreaded going home because there's no food. Um, of course, I see that on a regular basis at home. Um, you know, many of you know already, we've got 29.9% of our children in Western North Carolina living in conditions of food insecurity. Um, it's probably even higher than that. We've got some new study results for Food in America that will come out next week. Um, I, I know many of you know already, but hunger, fear, confusion, and depression are the constant companions of your children who, through absolutely no fault of their own, find success without food. Um, these children need more than hope to survive and thrive. But for many of these kids, breakfast is hope. And as the two of you just said, to be able to know, to get up in the morning and go have breakfast, wow, that is so powerful. So thank you so much for doing that. Um, I also want to say, um, of course, Savannah, we feel that all children should be nourished every day. Um, and for those of you that know already and that war aren't, it is Hunger Action Month this month, and so Mana has a huge series of uh, events, programs, initiatives that we're doing every day this month. Um, and in fact, I've got a flyer that I'd love to distribute to some of the schools. Uh, Wednesday at the Mountain State Fair, the food drive with five cans of food, get it free. All the food, of course, will be distributed um, through Manor Food Bank. Uh, we have our Empty Bowls event, on Depot's doing an event. Um, we just have tons of partners helping us. So thank you so much for all that you do for our children. Telling us the truth. 
that there's nothing being hidden from us, and that we can depend on each of you to tell us what we need to know. Ms. Bowman? Yes. If you will see Ms. Blunt, mm -hmm. I should be glad to help you with that information. Thank you. Advocacy 